Curtis! Glad you could make it, Gordon. I knew the hordes of security guards wouldn't be enough to stop you. I thought you might like to know. It's been five years since I lost my wife and daughter, and with them, my soul. Hey, he's giving us his life story. Should we attack now? No, we have to listen. The rival always has a tragic past. May I continue? Oh, please, by all means. As I was saying, it's been five years since I lost my wife and daughter, and with them, my soul. Back then, I was a top scientist, burning with a passion to save the Earth. If it wasn't for that fateful incident... Five years ago? As a result of the explosion in the lab, I lost my family and 70% of my body. A group of anti-space development terrorists were to blame. You mean your wife and daughter were victims of that incident? That's right. You caught the culprits, but what comfort would that be to me? I swore to my wife and child since the Defender of Earth couldn't do his job, I would take his place. And I became a cyborg to do just that. What good is the Defender of Earth if he can't save innocent people? A true Defender would do anything in his power to save as many people as possible. I can't accept anything less. I will defeat you, Gordon, and claim the title of true Defender of Earth. That is the only path left to me. So that's it. I didn't know you had such a past, Curtis. It was all due to my failings. Forgive me. But what you're doing now, Curtis, is not the right way. What? I'm fighting for the sake of humanity. Invading the netherworld might save the Earth. But it would require many sacrifices. Is that what you want? Is that really for the sake of Earth? You should know best what it feels like to be a victim, Curtis. What will your wife and daughter think up in heaven? I am the Defender of Earth. My duty is to right what is wrong, even if it means that I must face a comrade in arms. I don't want to fight you, but this is for your own good. Here I come, comrade. Behold, the true spirit of a defender!
Yeah! Go!
try. Go! Drop dead. Punk!
Drop dead. Punk! Come on, dude! Well done. You've proven me wrong. I felt the true defender's spirit, the strength of your determination, even in this mechanical body. I lost. Now, finish me. Okay. We'll kill you in one painless blow. You can't! Curtis. Our battle has already ended. You tried to do what you thought was right. It's just that your sorrow drove you to do it in the wrong way. That's why I want you to fight by my side, as a comrade. How about it? Gordon. I could use a skilled person like you as one of my vassals. <laughs> the Overlord's vassal. That doesn't sound too bad. But... It seems that my body needs to recharge. I must sleep for a while. Gordon, be careful of... Jennifer. Curtis! Be careful of Jennifer? What does he mean by that? Be careful... of... Jennifer? Are you thinking what I'm thinking? Modification? Mm-hmm. Modification. Will you three grow up already? 